Hey YouTube, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be showing you all how to get trillions of crowns in Saber Simulator. So as you can see, I'm kind of out of crowns right now because I did buy a whole bunch of the newest egg and I got the shiny Deadly Dark Dominus along with three shiny hazmats. I spent so much on that egg, but if I farmed a whole bunch of crowns, doing this i could get trillions so if you look on the crown leaderboard the top people have trillions so i'm not gonna say insane numbers this is an actual guide on how to actually get trillions of crowns since well it's pretty easy actually if you just do what i do but the first thing you gotta do the most important thing out of everything is you always have to get pets so you need crowns to get pets, so I'll be telling you all of the other stuff to do with crowns, but auras are a waste of money after you get the 2.5 or 3 times one, because it only increases by 0 0.5 times, so it starts becoming useless for how many crowns it costs. But you gotta make sure to get pets, so whenever you get crowns from doing anything, always spend it on pets. And if you're not sure if you should save up, just get the easiest pet that you can get. And then uh, get pets like that until you're good enough to get one of the better pets. But yeah, let's start with what you can do to get crowns fast. So the first most important thing out of everything is flags. Besides pets, since pets require crowns, the best thing to do... That doesn't involve already needing crowns flags you have to always try to claim as many flags as you can in the description i'll link a video that shows all of the flag locations for the first few or all of the islands except for the last two because on the last two islands they added some new flags but whenever they update then i'll show all of the flags on all like nine or ten islands because it would not really be that helpful because people can just do this and find the ones on the two but whenever they have at least three or four more islands from the last video i'll make another video on all flags but if you want to find out almost all the flags check the description and so next thing that's really important is the boss now one flag might not be that helpful, so uh, capturing flags will actually take a while. So, uh, you want to attack the boss as much as you can. Especially, actually totally for lower levels. Don't try to get the flags, people will easily steal them. Unless if they're secretly hidden, like almost all of the ones in the air. Then just try to get the uh, crowns from the boss, because that would be the easiest way. And also, the boss gives some coins. It's not helpful for most ranks, but really low ranks. The coins from the boss are really helpful. So the boss is really good if you're low rank to get coins and crowns. And just crowns if you're high rank. Because let's just go over to the boss real quick. Because whenever I fight the boss, I get 30 billion. So if it spawns every 3 minutes, then that could be roughly like half a trillion per hour but then that means a trillion every two hours so just a few hours of farming and i'll have like 2.5 trillion so that seems like a pretty good way and also if you take into account all of the flags and stuff if i had all of the flags too then that would be like one or actually maybe two to three trillion per hour so that'd be really overpowered you saw i just started attacking this boss at the end when it was really low health and about to die and i have gotten 10 billion crowns from it so far so actually before the update i got 25 billion per boss now i get about 150 billion even 250 billion if i just attack the boss like the whole time that it's there. But I haven't really been attacking the boss much because I to get my crowns mostly since I'm kinda lazy getting crowns since it takes a long time. I mainly just capture 
few secret flags, and then just like a. But that's how I got most of my crowns. But you see how many crowns I just got for that. Again, I spent all my crowns, so that's why I don't have that many. Now the next thing, which is only good for strong people, and it takes forever, is of course the hill. And this one, you have to be near the top of the server to be able to hold it. There's so many pros. Like this guy right here, he's the top of the server. He has way more rank than me. And that guy is also one of the top server. So he has... Wait, does he have five pets? It looks like he has five pets. Oh, that's just a train, that's why. But he has a train and a rainbow of those. He has insanely strong stuff. So he yeah, he's gonna be really strong and almost impossible to fight. I accidentally hit him, but he tried to hit me back. I don't know if he wants to have peace. Oh no. I'm gonna ask guy is actually following me. I think he might be a fan because he's following me. So I'm gonna tell Oh, he said, the guy that attacked me said sorry in the chat. I was about to end his entire career. But, yeah, that's how to get crowns really fast. Uh, with this new YouTube update thing that's happening, I'll probably be switching over to my other channel. If I have to mark my channel as for kids, I'll continue making videos. But probably only a few times a week. I'll mainly make videos on my other channel, which you can find on in the link of the description. So, yeah, subscribe to that and also subscribe to this one. Because uh, if you mark your channel as for kids, there's no notifications. That doesn't even violate any of the government's rules. I guess they just added that to make everyone but yeah there will be no notifications at all so i don't know what to do hopefully i don't have to also my last video i made the ninja legends diss track that was just a joke so many kids playing ninja legends got mad i probably lost a lot of but I literally said in the beginning of the video that was just a joke, so, yeah, that's everything, one last thing though, so that's not everything, I guess, quick shout out to all my channel members, if you want to see your name on this list, all you have to do is press the join button to the left of the subscribe button, and your name will be on this list next video, so shout out to all of them, and also if I have to mark my channels for kids, no channel members, no notifications, no live stream, uh, no subscriber count displayed on my channel. Also, way more limited view counts. Like I can't even see who's doing my videos. I can just see how many views I have, like that. Yeah, so I'm probably going to be switching, even though I've worked for a video, or actually two to three videos every single Probably spent at least, like, half of every day for one of the videos. I've been basically putting my last completely into the... So, yeah, make sure to subscribe to my other channel just in case if anything happens, but yeah, yes, gonna be the end of the video, if you have any suggestions for making videos on anything in Saber Simulator, or Ninja Legends, or anything else, let me know in the comments, and if it's a good idea, I'll make a video on it, right now I'm making uh, guides on videos for Ninja Legends, Saber Simulator, and Blocks Peace, so, yeah, I guess that's everything now, so, see you all in the next video, hopefully see you there, and yeah, bye YouTube.